Now, do you guys want to play Destiny 2 early? Well, here's your chance. If you want to win one of my weekly beta call giveaways for Destiny 2, simply drop a like on this video and leave a comment. Winners will be picked and announced on a Sunday. So the more you comment and like my videos, the more of a chance you've got of winning one of these beta codes. Good luck. What is going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny video and today I bring you this top 5 what the fuck moments. Now before we get into the video, if you guys do enjoy it, leaving a like is much appreciated on my behalf. And also guys, to be in with a chance of winning my weekly Destiny 2 Better Call giveaway, simply drop a comment down below. Now getting straight into the video. In at number 5, we have a clip sent in by JSTAR779. This kind of pisses me off as it's happened to me also. When you do everything fine, but Axis don't give a fuck. Got some cannons, huh? Back, back, back. Yeah, I got play, I got play. Oh my god, I got I got I got I got I got. I got first cannon. Wait, okay. What, what? Wait, what? What the fuck? What? What the fuck? What the What the oh, fuck? No. Oh, bit. In at number 4, we have a clip sent in by Anthony Thing. So, too many orbs now breaks the game. Seems that way to me. Um, what the fuck? Dude, my warlock was. Yeah, with it. Dude, what's going on? What? What the hell? What? what? Yo, I think we got too many orbs on the ground. What's happening? Oh shit. There was all of a sudden supplicants like on top of me. What just happened? Like, they weren't even. Yeah. Like I. There was nothing, and then all I'll of a sudden there was three solo supplicants. Left. I'll solo left. <laughs> In at number 3, we have a clip sent in by Orbital Jaguar 53. When Warpriest goes all Gandalf and shit, you shall not pass! In at number 2, we have a clip sent in by King Hall 26 Now this is a true what the fuck moment, unless someone with a bit of logic can explain it down below in that comments section. Here we see a guy shoot a single guardian but get a collateral kill. It isn't like the game glitched or something and he killed the same person twice, I've seen that before. It's actually two different people in the kill feed, so what the fuck actually happened here? Clearly there's only one person there, you only see one kind of like um, damage hit marker. So what the fuck happened? I have no idea. In at number one, we have a clip sent in by the Che Cole Gamer. Now, first off, this isn't new, but I thought I would cover it seeing as there's many of you players who did not know about it. Basically, when doing the new Necrochasm quest, you first have to upgrade your Husk of the Pit to the Edelon Ally, that being a legendary weapon. Now, obviously, the end result to this quest is an exotic weapon, but if you are at the final stages of this Necrochasm quest and you already have an exotic equipped, say in your secondary or heavy, the Edelon Ally still upgrades to the Necrochasm, but it adds another slot to your primary inventory if it it's full and equips you with what looks to be a developer weapon of some kind. Looks to me like a red death, just black, but it's an auto rifle. 
Weird that I know, but it is the result of not being able to equip two exotics at the same time. Once you change your weapon or equip the Necrochasm, this weapon is lost for good, but it isn't the first time we've seen it, and I'm pretty sure it won't be the last. But guys, that is to end this top 5 what the fuck moments. If you enjoyed the video, hitting that like button is much, much appreciated. Remember, if you've got anything badass to send in, send it into the email I just linked in the top of the video description. If you guys are new around here and enjoy what you see and enjoy daily Destiny content, be sure to subscribe. Also, hit that bell button next to that subscribe button to get email notifications of when I upload so you never miss a video. And I will, as always, guys, catch you on that next one. in the wrong knowing where we stand but you and I will carry on we never get it right